Yes, how's everybody doing today? Yeah, it's uh, September 1st, and uh, yeah, we got fall here. It's starting. It, it's really coming on, and uh, you can tell it because the heavy stuff is falling, uh, acorns. You know, our park is loaded with acorns now. I mean, wow. Them squirrels are going to have some work. Yeah. But you know what the funny part? I mean, there's thousands and thousands and thousands of them everywhere. I mean, it's like walking on marbles. But come later in the year, they'll be cleaned up. Them squirrels, they do all the work when it comes to cleaning them up. Yeah, they don't care about leaves. Yeah, that's the, the crappy part. We got to take care of those. But uh, acorns, yeah, they got that. that. Just leave it right there. I'll, I'll get it when I get a chance. And that's exactly what they do. Man, they're scurrying everywhere. And living high on the hog. <laughs> yeah, that's the way it is. Oh, I wish I got Deb here to see all this. She's Now she's missing the summer. Or she's already missed the summer. And the fall's coming. The leaves will be changing colors. Yeah. You know... He, he did want me to tell you guys that uh, he's authorizing any of uh, those people that are in charge that still have their head in their ass. We, uh, dude, whatever it takes, put two D10s on them, all right? Use cloth straps, you know, be gentle. But to be perfectly honest with you, if, if, if they rip their head off trying to get it out of their ass, they were meant to be a forever grave anyway. So no, no harm, no foul, all right? So uh, yeah, just a couple D10s get that head out of their ass please we really need to get this moving and going and uh yeah like i said if it if it, if it happens it happens it's okay uh yeah they were meant to be a forever grave dumbasses we really need to get on with this you know what i mean burn it's one of them things that you know uh, what else can he show you without proof okay we we, we can't really give you proof and, and uh, and then on top of it, you know, I'm, I'm steering in all directions. Uh, yeah, probably don't really want to do the DC and 10s thing. But, you know, I, as the Antichrist, do it, damn it, do it. And then we'll put someone else in charge. Because, <laughs> i tell you the truth, we need someone else in charge. So bad. This is getting old. This is getting really old. And uh, we we got to move forward here, folks. We really do, you know. It's like that seed of that acorn, you know, it, that the seed is getting so damn heavy that uh, it's time for it to drop. It, the season has come for it to drop all over the world. And then we have to start watering it. And we can't do that when most people don't even know about it. You know, it, it's time that uh, we start spreading this a little bit bigger and letting everybody else in on the the uh, story of uh, the eternal life because to be perfectly honest with you we've already lost a lot of good people that uh, we screwed up with on Easter and these are people that didn't get a fair shake but we gave them a fair shake up on the top side and uh, because this is the tribute years so uh, but they could have been better. And uh, they could still be here. And uh, how many more do we got to lose? How many more do we have to uh, sacrifice? Because uh, you guys are afraid. Do you have the faith and the logic to understand what's going on? And what really is at stake. Every one of his souls. Every single one of his. And, and they're being misled. By the thousands. Every day. Because they think there's some holy ointment oil. That uh, anointing and whatever bullshit's going on. The reviews in medical care. I, I seen the one dude. I'm, I, he's got a shirt. Fully vaccinated by Jesus. All right. Yeah, fully vaccinated by Jesus. Yeah, that's how they believe. 
because that's how they've been taught. And that's about as stupid as it comes. You know, you, you, you need to trust your doctor. Not Jesus when it comes to that avatar. Because, uh, yeah, to be honest with you, like I said, that's out of his hands. It's in your hands. You decide how you're going to take care of your temple. And if you want to ignore your doctors and let uh, the awfuls of uh, this boot camp take it, then you get shortchanged a lot of t uh, uh, points. Because the truth is, you need to be doing the right thing. But how can you do the right thing when the pastor's telling you it's okay? Yeah, God's got you. Yeah, don't worry about that doctor. That doctor's stupid. Yeah. Really? Yeah, just donate. Yeah, give. Yeah, send me a check. Send me a check, and, and I'm going to make sure God takes care of you. I am going to make sure he takes care of you. Oh, you died. Oh, I am so sorry. Yeah, I cashed that check. Sorry. Sorry, but, it, you know, it was his will. It was his will. Yeah, it was his time. We got to help these people. Yeah. There's believers all over the world that are misguided. They got to understand the real score and the real world we're in. And their eternal souls scorecard. It's time, guys. Like I said, uh, we just got to do the right thing. We got to make the right choices. And it starts at the top. So, uh, anyway, that's about all for right now. I, uh, he's got another carrot in front of me. He had one here for me. I forgot some change up here and made me walk all the way back up to this damn spot. And, uh, yeah, of course the chains are gone some bit. You know, that, it's one thing to have that carrot in front of me and, and, and to go and charge after it. And then to find out the damn thing wasn't even there to start with. Mm. Guys, you have no idea what I've been going through. Yeah, some bit. It's going to be all right, though. I'm going to get a suit with a flap. That's that's one day and, and a beautiful queen that uh, I can't wait to get a chance to talk to her but I gotta talk to her first you guys know the score you know how this has to go you know exactly what we gotta do are you ready cause I sure in the hell am and so is he anyway yeah like I said do it dude D10's whatever whatever it takes <laughs>